to be wild. Carl Reindler. That's straight ahead off Skyline. He hasn't been able to... There's a left-hand kink in the road. Greg Murphy is doing it again here in the top 10 shootout at Bathurst. And you've got yourself all psyched to put together what you hope to be the best lap of the year. And then it rains. And away we go. And Will Davison takes over the lead of the race. Big crunch at the top of the wall. And Wind Cup will get the lead of the race. And hard. Luke Hewlett just went straight ahead. Will he get Jack Perkins? He sure will. Oh, Ooh. in the wall. Too much space. So Perk had a mistake there by being courteous. Oh, Greg did a big mistake. He's going to rotate this. If he ends up in the gravel, he won't get out. Lowndes gets his next position in the queue, which takes him up to third in the pits. That's Dean Fiore. Oh, here we go. Trouble at the top with Forrest Elbow. And round goes uh, John McIntyre. Fuel on the road. This is a big, big incident turn two so safety car will be deployed we've got 120 litres they've just gone through the driver change so it's David Bernard in the car out goes the Petters safety car and this is a very big incident at turn two Dunlop control tire just flailing debris everywhere in the chase they'll have to be mindful of that because that could cut down other tires I'm just looking at the computer screen while everyone's left the battery voltage is on zero there's oil everywhere down there Craig Lowndes has now gone to second position in the great race of 2011. One more opportunity for Craig Lowndes to have a crack. It's been more than 30 years since a rookie claimed victory at Mount Panorama in a legendary finish. This is the year of the rookie of the prize.